Welcome back to my podcast. Today we have a special appearance of rapper Stiffy Flip. Now, she's not your average rapper. She's actually better. And she's here today to tell us all about her creative arts journey. She's learned a few things such as dance, music and art painting that is now let me bring her along yep so it's, it's my rapper um now we've been told that you've had a lot of time a lot of hours trying to learn all these new instruments and i know it's not you i know you're not used to this type of stuff so Give it away. Tell us about your life. Show us what you've done for us. Yep. Whatever. I'll show you. It's pretty good. Took a lot of time, but whatever. You can see it. According to Dunphy ETAL 2019, the creative arts forms dance movement, drama, music, and visual arts, and is internationally targeted to help depression and associated symptoms. This is beneficial for teachers because creative arts can form a safe space for teachers. And with art integration having significant effects on academic achievement, La Mote 2018. I continue to learn a dance off my sister as she studied a Bachelor of Dance at ACPE. I will start with dance. Dance plays a role in education, such as teaching physical skills, engagement or performance, pain and costas 2020. This video showcases the time and effort I put into learning these dances and how it is a physical skill. In the first video, I learned a YouTube dance, which I found difficult because it was a lyrical dance. A study was conducted with students stating the choreographer pushed them through their comfort zone and was thrilled to be learning something new. Haynes and Torres 2016. While this was the case with me for my lyrical dance. During the dance, I knew I had to show emotion. The reason for this is because dance can stimulate, modify and express emotions in art form through the physical expression, movement and rhythm of relationships, feelings, thoughts and ideas. Haynes and Torres 2016. I utilise TikTok to help me learn a popular dance from the TV series Dance Moms. Throughout my teaching career, I can utilise technology which meets the standards 2.6 Information and Communication Technology, Australian Institute for Teaching and School Leadership, AITSL 2014. I also tried to learn other TikTok dances which can be described as a choreographed dance in a series of movement that is arranged into pieces, Survey 2021. I struggled with understanding the moves, although I constantly watched TikTok, I did not expect it to be this hard. Now we move on to music, which I chose to play the piano with the help of an app on my phone. My first few attempts I did struggle, but I knew I had to keep practicing. According to Cheng and Southcott 2022, in learning piano, practice is vital. Practice is fundamental for musicians to be able to manage and grasp their learnings if they want to advance their performing skills. While I try to teach the students at my school, I will meet standard 6.3, engage with colleagues and improve practice. This will be done through asking teachers for constructive feedback on how I play the piano and if this will be helpful to help me become a better teacher for my students. It took me several hours and patience for me to understand how to play the piano. The benefits of learning for children are improved attention, concentration and memory. Molero ETAL 2020. While it took me five hours to perfect how I play the piano, I had to concentrate and memorize what I had played previously. I never learnt how to play the piano as a child, but research states that the piano lessons are beneficial on the cognitive ability and emotional state of a child, Monday 2020. I continue to learn other songs because some songs I tried to learn were difficult for a beginner level. 
I was surprised and proud of myself on how I learned to play the piano. I tried to practice popular songs and songs that I was familiar with and was shocked when I listened to myself play those songs. Playing the piano was rather challenging but rewarding. I'm glad I learned it. Throughout learning how to paint, I assumed I would not do too well, but I rather made myself proud and was happy with the result. I started by watching YouTube videos on how to paint certain artworks. While the YouTuber was demonstrating each step, teachers demonstrate and perform certain skills or techniques for the student to observe or listen to and learn from. Simone's ETAL 2017. This is beneficial as it teaches me how to teach my students how to paint an artwork. I watched the YouTube videos on how to paint and utilize different skills and techniques on how to paint my artwork. It is important for me as a teacher to implement art as T Barnes 2015 states, art is the way children describe their experiences they have had, which can give their art meaning. When I enter the classroom, I want my children to draw what they want, make artworks of how they feel and how they wish to express themselves. In this video, I made a mistake and accidentally mixed colours together. Therefore, I changed papers and fixed up the work that I missed. As an educator, I would like to encourage students when they are making art, that it is okay to make mistakes. It is okay to learn just as I am learning. In this next video, I watched a YouTube video of how a male artist utilized this technique to draw his painting, which was successful when I implemented this. When I become a teacher, I will utilize standard 2.2 Content Selection and Organisation, AITSL 2014. By implementing dance, music and art to my content and ensuring it is taught with passion to help bring out the children's creativity. While I created several paintings, I realised it was time for me to make my own painting just by looking at an image. I took what I learnt from YouTube and made paintings by myself by painting, looking at an image, and I was rather successful and happy with how it turned out. I was impressed with what I learned in the space of five hours, and I was happy with my result. I did not expect to achieve this result. I am aware of the importance of implementing art units after what I have learned in this unit. I am aware of how tiring and exhausting exhausting it really is. I will ensure the students if I can achieve this then anyone can and I'm hoping they end up loving the arts as much as I have now. Thank you.